We have new reporting here tonight after that horrific limousine crash in upstate New York that killed 20. We knew the limo had failed an inspection just last month, but tonight ABC News obtaining part of the inspection report, revealing at least in part why the limo failed the inspection. Here's ABC's David Curley with that report. A line of hearses carrying some of the 20 victims to a funeral home after the extended limo ran a stop sign, slamming into an embankment at high speed. Those emergency workers used the jaws of life to cut open the limo. We were pulling bodies out. They were still alive. And we kept going. Government inspectors found 22 violations in the company's four vehicles in the past two years. This particular limo had six violations just a month ago, a brake system monitor that wasn't working. The governor saying the limo should not have been on the road. The upstate New York company claiming repairs had been made. Prestige uh, had been working with the state uh, to make sure that the vehicles were roadworthy. Tonight, New York State pushing back, saying an out-of-service sticker like this should have been on the limo. The driver of the 17-year-old stretched SUV, also killed, didn't have the proper license to carry that many passengers. Family saying that he was concerned. The wife told me that he had complained to her regarding um, the condition of some of the vehicles. Four sisters and family celebrating a birthday killed in one accident brought 2,500 members of the community together to remember what they and one family lost in this horrific accident. And David Curley joins us now from the crash scene. And David, you reported there that family members of the limo driver claimed he was worried about the company's vehicles, but there was also reporting that some of the victims in the car had texted their concerns before the accident. One family says they got texts about concerns about the condition of the vehicle. One saying the engine was so loud they were going deaf. But tonight, David, still no word from authorities about why that limo Across this highway at such a high rate of speed. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.